Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. This is actually a range review for the 80% Arms GST-9. I reviewed it last week and I went through all the specifics, so that's not what this is about. This is a range review. I didn't put hundreds of rounds through it, but I did put enough to get a good feel for the pistol. And I have to say, this is pretty exciting for me. It shot like a Glock. Now, I don't know about you, but when I shoot a Glock, it shoots just a little bit low, so I had to raise the sight. I figured that out with my first couple shots. So instead of talking about it here, let's head out to the range, and you can check that out for yourself. 80% arms, GST-9, right here. First shots. Let's see how it goes. All right, so it, it was, it took a, the first couple shots to see where it was hitting. I think I was hitting a little bit low, so I raised that front sight a little bit and did much better. But here it is, 80% arms GST-9. Very happy with it. I did a table review on it, and I said that this is what Glock could have been or should have been, especially in terms with the frame. If you look at the frame, it, it kind of has a... Uh, sig like grip texturing and it does come with a couple back straps one that fits this right here which is uh, the glock 19 mag 15 round glock 19 mag or you can replicate the glock 19x with a back strap and extension there with the 17 round mag that is super cool but what i really like are those slide cuts and a fluted barrel so it's a beautiful looking gun in flat dark earth. Does have a full pick rail there. A, a Glock trigger, you know, Glock light trigger. It's a GST-9, but the Glock light trigger, a little bit heavier, probably six and a quarter, six and a half pounds, but it does have the scales on top, those slide cuts, Glock sights, and it is optic ready. Cut to fit a RMR or a Halson 407. I believe that's what it is. But it's a cool gun. It's definitely a, a good looking gun. Those were my first shots. I, I shot low, which tells me that that's how I shoot the Glocks too, just a little bit low. So I'm gonna load it up and take a few more shots, but I have to say, it's pretty nice. It certainly looks nice. Now, I, oh, one more thing. You can order the lower. If you have a Gen 3 upper, and that will fit, you can order the lower shipped right to your house, unserialized and all that, and it it's a nice lower like it it's if you love glock and you want something a little more without having to to pay for all those accessories and upgrades and everything you could do that with this 80 percent arms gst9 or you can get the full build kit which is what this is the full build kit completely installed right there and you can see it is optic ready and so this is everything that people do to their glocks in one package right around 800 bucks and you could put it together yourself all right now i'm gonna load it up and shoot it some more there it is 80% arms, GST-9, range review, could be 10 degrees out here, some wind coming in. It performed very well at the range. I consider this an accessorized up Glock 19 with many more options. Primarily the backstrap that gives the 19X feel with the 17 round mags. I really like that, but the fluted barrel is certainly cool and the way it looks is nice too. And some of the options being that it's optic ready right out of the box this is a full build and like i mentioned in the video it's it's right around 800 bucks and people put thousands of dollars into their glocks and this comes the way it is looking the way you're looking at it right now with the full build i plan to do more with it 
I want to put some more rounds through it and perhaps do some comparisons with other handguns as well. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.